If people have beaten her, let me know in the comments. No, I'm serious. Let me know in the comments, how do I beat this? Hey guys, Zek Mars here, and welcome back to Shovel Knight King of Cards. So we're nearing the approach for the Enchantress. Um, in the last episode, we beat the Tower of Justice and got all five merit medals there. We also got a couple of cards, lost a couple of cards to some of the fights, and in any case, we're going to be moving on. And there's a Liquid Samurai right there. Already does not fill me with a whole lot of confidence. Alright. Fortunately, they're very frail, so I don't think we're going to be having much trouble with them. Uh. down here. Oh. I see. I think. Liquid Samurai aren't very strong, but they can't but they can be very dangerous because of how they work. Alrighty. This is going well, I think. I see why it's called Lava Pit. Alright. So they're very fast enemies. Well, fortunately the AI isn't very smart. I think I might have an easier time with this than I thought I was going to. Ah, oh, there it is. Oh. Pooping out flames. Well. Alright, now it's giving out the chicken. Alright, where are they, all the medals? Well, this is potentially very dangerous because they shit out flames. Oh, you! You again. Alright, that's my second one. And there's my death. Okay. Well, I got two out of three. I don't know where the third one is. 
I know where the third one is, but that's okay. We'll figure it out as we go along. Alright. Ice physics. Fun. This is not going to be fun. Uh, and I was right. There it is. that mirror metal. No. Okay. Well, this isn't very hard. <laughs> A little annoying, but that's to be expected. It is the second to last level in the whole game. I'd be more concerned if it wasn't hard. Physically. Physically, I know where it is and, and how to get to it. It's just a matter of skill. Up. I'm assuming this is the last room. Yeah, this definitely feels like it's the last room. Okay. Yeah, because the rat ray rope is right there. Alright. Alright, so I know where... So now I know where the last level of the game is.
All right, just focus. This is the last room. Last room. We're go we're golden after we get past that room. At least I'm assuming. I I I I, I should probably not assume because it makes an ass out of you and me. There it is! Alrighty. And that is all 12. Alright. So there is indeed three more in the in the last level of Tower of Fate. Alright. Well, in any case, let's go return, return these for a reward. Um, and how much time do I have? How much time have I... Okay, 15 minutes... Do I have enough? Yeah, I got plenty of time. 120, I get a reward for 120. Another for... Okay. And the towers all fell like the rains in the spring, and when word reached the village, they cried for their king. But the king was alive in a terrible way, and the dust turned to dirt and the green turned to gray. Alright. I have a feeling that might be foreshadowing or something. I'm not entirely sure. Um, But in any case... In the last episode, if you remember, um, we attempted to be a boss here. We're talking to this to this lady here. All right, we gotta beat her in a justice match first, so we're gonna do that real quick. And I figured out the trick to this. I watched a uh, boss fight databases playthrough of, playthrough of the fight. Um, apparently, I was right. You are supposed to jump off the crystals and nail her in the head. So yeah, we got fighter. We got fighter as a justice player, and then as an actual boss. I don't think I lose a card for this. No. All right, I gotta ref I gotta redo the justice match again. I got lucky the first time, didn't I? She's not normally supposed to be that easy. I think I got this, but I don't think I'm gonna win the fight in in the time I thought I had. All right. Well, I beat it. Had a blubber meanie, but I didn't mean to take the blubber meanie. All right, all right, all right. We've seen this, so now we gotta just get into the fight. We have no magic. That's the draw back of this fight. I can get her past her first phase, but I'm going to need to practice this. I am definitely going to need to do some practice with this and maybe do it on. I don't know. I will someday beat this. I'm not now, but someday soon. Uh, this super boss is definitely different. Definitely tougher than some of the other super bosses. It's definitely tougher. She's definitely tougher than some of the other bosses. Because you have no relics to fight her with. Yeah, as a boss, she's not that challenging. It's just... Her AI is pretty easy to memorize. It's just that... Oh, now she's mixing it up. Oh, now she's using more than one. She's using more than one type of crystal. Yeah, in order to get actually get to her, you have to hit her on the head. Yeah, her fight get got a lot more hectic.
It's not so much that she's hard, it's just memorizing what all of her different crystals do. But yeah, the... The combo of having to fight her in Justice and then fight her as an actual boss is... A bit rough for some people, I can definitely tell. If people have beaten her, let me know in the comments. No, I'm serious. Let me know in the comments, how do I beat this? Yeah, and also I learned that if you don't actually bounce off the crystals to get to her head, she'll, she will do the ramming thing where she goes down below the stage and tries to hit you that way. So overall, this fight is geared toward the fact that you have to be, that you basically have to be able to win this. It's not like they can just make it ridiculously hard. Ow. Red I have not seen before. Oh, shockwaves. Shockwaves, fun. Yeah. Shockwaves. Fun. Okay. Alright, I'll make one last attempt at her. I don't think they'll beat her, though. I didn't even die to the shockwaves that died to her. <laughs> Alright. Well, I made an, an attempt at it. I will not be her in the playthrough. I can already tell you that right now. Also, I know what she gives you as a reward. It's all, it's worth it if you want it, but... I don't know. I'll, I'll collect it. It'll be fine. Oh. Alright, I think I'm done. <laughs> oh, I did not beat her. I got stuff I need to do, so I need to move on. But... Alright. Yeah, I did not beat her. Alright, well... I got one last stage before I have to leave it, leave the final boss. Um, so... I don't know. I'll probably beat her off camera. I, I probably won't beat her on camera. You've seen me fight her, so I don't think I'll leave her. I don't think I'll leave a fight for her on camera. Um, but I will explain what she, get, what she gets it when I get to it. But I'll explain what she gives you. That's what I'll do. So... Yeah, in any case, I think I am going to leave this episode here. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to follow me on Facebook and on Twitter in the description below. And also, check out my Patreon in the description below as well. It's only a couple bucks a month, and it really helps me out. And you guys get access to a bunch of cool perks that are my way saying thanks. So be sure to check those out in the description below as well. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace!